How's it going everybody? Welcome back to the channel here. In today's video, I'm going to go ahead and tell you how you can update your third generation of AirPods to the current farmer version. Now, before we go ahead and tell you how you can do that, now why you should update your um, third generation of AirPod for it. Let's you're having the minor issues with your third generation of AirPod, you cannot connect it with your iPhone, or if you have any other problem, updating to the current farmer version will help you to solve the problem. Now, before you go ahead and update your third generation of AirPod to the current software version or the farmer version, you need to check which farmer version that you are actually running on. In order to check that out, make sure that your AirPod, I mean the third generation of AirPod is connected with your iPhone. Right after that, just open up your settings and scroll down to your Bluetooth and from there, you simply tap on this eye option from their AirPod. Just scroll down here. Well, if you just come over here to the version, then you'll be able to see the current software version that is currently running over here, which is 4C170. Now, once you just check this out, now get out of here and now open up your browser. From there, just go ahead and open up your Google and then you have to type AirPod 3 Farmer version and then you'll be able to see the current version that is actually available for all the third generation of AirPod. Now, if you see the difference from here, then you need to update your AirPod. If you see the, the, the same version that you see we're currently having with your AirPod, that means you don't have to update that. Now, if you see the difference, now if you want to update that, the next thing that you have to do, you have to make sure that your case is actually having 50% of charge. At the same time, your AirPod should be about 50% charge and more in order to update it. Once you make sure those things up, the next things you have to do, make sure it is connected with your iPhone and now you have two different things that you guys can do. Either you can use your AirPod for about 20 minutes or more, or you can simply leave your AirPod third generation on a table right next to your iPhone, just give it about 20 to 30 minutes and the new software will be auto updated. So these are the ways that you guys can need to follow in order to just update your farmer version on your iPod third generation. Alright guys, hope you found this video useful. If you think so, go ahead and leave a like and subscribe to the channel to get more useful video content for yourself. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you later.